Well, folks, it is time to break out the tongs, the spinners, and the blenders because May is salad month. And what a better chance to get out there and support your local farmer's market and get all your nutrition and vitamins and all the good stuff with all of this local produce. So here to help walk us through the farmer's market and what to do with the produce, let's welcome nutritionist Jesse Lane Lee to Global News Morning. Thank you so much for taking the time and this beautiful yes. setup couldn't be more seasonal. Um, so what are some of the, it's still early in the growing season, so a lot of people might think, uh, I can't get anything, but what is available if you do head out? Yeah, so the farmer's markets, they're going to start popping up all over the place yeah. this weekend, next weekend. We're going to see so much great local produce. Some of the big ones here is asparagus. Asparagus is so delicious. It has a really short growing season, so it's only a few weeks. Okay. So when you see that asparagus, you got to grab it right yeah, away yeah, because get it's it while so it's, good. While it's getting good. That's right. So I have a salad here where I use the asparagus. It looks so delicious and some unique ingredients. It looks unique. Unique ingredients. Yeah. And I wouldn't think to do this. What's so it's it? a warm asparagus potato salad. A little bit different from your traditional kind of mayo-based salad. Mm -hmm. I put a really nice zesty lemon vinaigrette. And I've roasted the potatoes and the asparagus. So when you take it out of the oven, it's nice and warm. Because it's still a little bit chilly in the spring, so yeah. it's like to have a warmer salad. Absolutely, and a heartier salad too, because I think that uh, can put a lot of folks off as well uh, when they think salad and grass mm. and rabbit food. There you go, a nice hearty bowl of, uh, of warm goodness, folks. Exactly. And then we have this beautiful spinach here. Yes, okay, we're going to make this one together. We're making this spinach quinoa strawberry salad. This is one of my favorite salads because usually we do strawberries in the same way. But we get to go savory this time, and strawberries are in season May. We have a beautiful long growing season for strawberries in Ontario. So we can take advantage of that spring and into the summer. So if you want to help me, I do want to help you. You can start cutting up those <laughs> strawberries Wonderful. and some fresh basil. Okay. I'm going to add quinoa. So I like to add Let's some sort of protein to all of my salads. When there's no protein, they're just not very filling, so it's not right. ideal. So I've got some quinoa there, and I'm going to sprinkle on some walnuts while you cut those strawberries. You don't have to do all of them. You okay, can just, just excuse my nails at home, folks. Okay. <laughs> there you go. And then for the dressing, I put strawberries in the dressing. Wonderful. Yeah, so yeah. it's really nice. It adds a beautiful cake color. And that's just a good old-fashioned uh, bullet there that we a lot of us have at home. Oh, so yeah. Just not so Nothing nice fancy. Use. Yeah. Nothing fancy. So we put <laughs> olive oil in there, some balsamic vinegar. And then even though the strawberries do give it sweetness, I'm going to add some way to get the bang for your buck. Uh, what's the best um, way to stretch these dollars in these uh, tough times now? Yeah, 100% local is so good. It supports the local economy. It's amazing. And you can get such good deals at farmer's markets. When something is in season, you can buy it in bulk and it's so much cheaper. And you're buying it at peak nutrient value because it's just been picked that morning. Wonderful. And it tastes the best. And then you can like get a ton of it and preserve it all year round. So I actually have a how to eat seasonally all year round one to learn that I offer to corporations where I walk you through what's in season from May all the way to September and give you lots of recipe inspiration along the way. Wonderful. And I tell you how to preserve it so you can enjoy it all year. And Jesse's now going to show us how to blend then, this and for how long. Until it's smooth. It's a little bit loud, but it's pretty quick there. A few little chunks, I maybe would have blended it a little bit longer. Oh, that's all right. We'll blend it to your preference, though, right? Exactly, maybe yeah. we like, some people like the chunks. That's right. And then we got these beautiful strawberries on there. And I like to put basil as well. I find basil is so delicious. It just adds. Wow. I wish you guys flavor. could smell that. Just from you moving those leaves, um, you can. Uh, it's just so aromatic as well. So you get yeah. that full sensory experience. Uh, while you, or I can do that and then okay. uh, walk us quickly through what we have here and um, also, you know, the farmer's market essentials. What do you not want to forget when you're heading to the farmer's market? Right, so you definitely want to bring your own reusable bag and you want to make sure you're buying all the amazing things that are in, in season and you can also, if you're looking to save money, go at the end of the day. Okay. Because those farmers, they want to offload all of the stuff that they haven't been able to sell and you can get really good deals so you can bargain with them a little bit. There you go, tips from Jesse, and right. some of those yes, deals so might be is, in there. That exactly. Bowl. This is the last one I brought. Onions, tomatoes, cucumbers, all going to be in season soon. This is a little bit different. It's a Tuscan white bean salad. It's 
So our protein source here is the white beans. And this one's inspired by the beautiful Mediterranean diet. I have a whole Mediterranean corporate cooking class that I run where we make this and a lemon poached fish. It's so good. The Mediterranean diet we love because it's incredible for love, inflammation, love, love. great for longevity, just good for us overall. So, so delicious. Hey, Jesse, time flies when we're having fun. Oh, There's know. a beautiful serving right there. Where can folks uh, find out more about what you do and more about all of this fantastic nutritional information? Yes, yeah, so you can head to my website, jessielanewellness.com, and you can learn about the corporate cooking classes I do and the corporate lunch and learns I run both in person and virtually, so you don't have to be in Toronto to take advantage of that. There you go. Wonderful. Thank you so much. Pleasure to meet you, and uh, come on by later in the season. Yeah. Uh, yeah. And stay with us here on Global News Morning. We have more of your news, weather, and traffic after the short break. Bon appetit. Yeah. Did I do a good job? Beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> it was beautiful.